Atlantic salmon, okay, um, from Costco. So I like this salmon. I prefer this one than the the the, the full size salmon uh, because again, this is um, portioned already. It comes um, pre-packaged, individual use. So um, let's say for instance, um, you go to work, you come back, just have this in the refrigerator. When you come back, pop it in the grill and you have your dinner, it's ready, okay? So it's very easy to use. User-friendly, convenient, and um, quite tasty. So what I'm doing right now is just, um, so in the bag you have one, two, three, four. It comes about seven. Yeah, seven pieces. So I see how four, four pieces in there with my three pieces um, already open. I love salmon. So it's one of my main dish. There comes the last one. Okay, so this is uh, seven pieces. I'm going to wash it and then come back and we shall season. <laughs> of course, it comes frozen, so you want to leave it out um, out of the freezer and put it in your fridge. Um, overnight or if you want to freeze it for dinner um, as you're about to step out of, from home just put it pull it out of the freezer put it in the fridge so by the time you come back from work it is well thawed and uh, ready for you to cook okay For the second time, I'm using a um, tepid water, like almost room temperature water. So the salmon is nice and clean. So at this point, we are going to season. So to season the salmon, I have here the lemon pepper seasoning, zesty lemon pepper seasoned salt. Okay, so um, you can choose to use natural lemon and just cut it in slice or in half and uh, squeeze the liquid into on your fish but in the absence of that I use the zesty lemon pepper seasoning salt then of course the cracked or crushed on um, pepper and here I'm gonna give it a little twist by adding um, Italian seasoning to just give it some herb taste as well and then of course um, cedar plank salmon with natural smoke flavor seasoning mix so this um, is uh, made by McCormick it kind of give it that um, rusty smoke flavor to it and then of course a dash of black pepper okay so I'm gonna start the seasoning process it's quite easy it doesn't come in any order um, whichever one you want to do first, you know, you start with. So I'm going to just sprinkle that. Of course, you don't want to sprinkle too much so that it's not uh, too much.
so salty of course and then after that I'm going to do the so if you notice what I'm doing I'm doing the grainy seasoning first then I will go with the dry hair bow seasoning okay you can smell the smoke flavor to it so just sprinkle that okay so this time around I'm going to flip it because you want to season both sides so that um, the fish in itself is adequately seasoned okay so you can see it's just a dusting okay all right so now comes my hair bath seasoning so the Italian flakes, Italian seasoning, perfect pinch, again by McCormick. So um, in my household here, we love my children. They love Italian seasoning, so we tend to use it quite often. You know, to give um, the Italian flavor, you know, to the food. Okay. And last is of course the black pepper meal, freshly ground pepper, black pepper. All right. So you just want to make sure everything is coated. You don't need to rub, 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 because you just want all of these things coated on it. Remember, we did a flip, so you have a coating on both sides. So let that sit for another 15 minutes, and then it will be ready for the grill. I will have to do this twice, or sometimes three, three times, because of the depends on the portion sizes. But with this double green, everything goes on at once. So that cuts the time you spend in the kitchen. So you can, um, so um, you can because you have the grill groups on both sides, so you really don't have to flip anything. We're going to cover it up. and allow it cook check back on it in five to seven minutes or when you see the real man it will be ready okay. all right so as you can see our fish is ready i'm gonna cut up the grill turn it off to zero degrees You can hear the sizzling, the green, see the grill mark, you see the head, you know, scattered on the fish itself. So it looks yum, yummy, yummy. Um, as you can, if you look on the side, you can see that the fish is still very juicy. Whereas on top, it is a crusty. That is perfection with a cooking right there. So remember I said you don't have to flip it. So because you have the groove on both sides, you see? So you have the front and the back with grill mark. So on a weekday what I do is I just prep this like this have it um, on the spread out um, a Paris container like this and then um, put it away 
that will serve me for the week, you know, serve my household for the week. So when I come from work, all I need to do is steam or stir fry some vegetable and dinner is ready. So you can see how efficient cooking that is. In 30 minutes, you have this ready. Voila! Mm. 